It's May 2nd, uh, 2022. I'm watching C... Uh, no, I'm watching Eyewitness News, the Channel 7, at noon. They have the most interesting thing. Some human um, did something via something called a story full. And uh, they have the credit up there. About a solar eclipse um, where the sun was setting... And it was like a, a crescent was almost taken out of the sun. Again, in this area within my life frame, um, they don't speak of like legendary things. They don't even... Like now, this news program is doing this story full thing um, with somebody who contributed. But the one tube of information as an adult I have access to um, and in my childhood held captivated in a room with professional teachers they didn't speak of um, really I had one class just one one earth science class but it was such a foreign concept and it went so fast just to pass a regent's exam. Um, it wasn't like building blocks that were professed and were built upon. And the information... See, like in, like, in a galaxy far, far away where, like, the human works in its environment properly and not in the dysfunction that I live in, um, when you learn something, it's like photographic and it stays with you and it, you digest it, you know it, you have access to it for whatever reason, the humans don't function that way in this North America area. I don't know why. So the earth science thing did not stick very well. Um, also, uh, Sam Champion, who's the meteorologist and Dave Navarro uh, they talk about they learned some legend of a wolf wolf eating a moon again I never heard of that I've seen it referenced by symbol that I accidentally bumped into the symbology but no historical context no reference no teachings no anything was immersed or introduced into my life frame. I don't know why that was. Check out this unique sunset in Chile. A partial eclipse created this stunning scene on Saturday. People mm. watching mm. the Pacific Ocean. It's a a crescent right. shadow on top of the sun. I just have to stop and look at that. Yeah, it's cool. That beautiful? Wow. Someone took a bite out of it. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. This is as it fell behind a vibrant orange skyline. This view of the eclipse could be seen from parts of South America and Antarctica. Uh, one eyewitness said it looked like someone took a bite. There you go. That was from David. Son, you were not the only one. <laughs> <laughs> what What is going on there, Sam? So it's so. Imagine what it was like a thousand years ago before we understood uh, eclipses. You know. Still don't understand eclipses. There's been no teachings. I don't know how, where they get their, where they source or vet their information from in this collapsing star system that I'm traversing through. It's confusing. Oh, and and so you 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 all the stories that were that came up, you know, the giant, you know, something a wolf that ate part of the moon or ate part of the sun out of it. We don't get the good stuff. We don't get our next partial solar eclipse until October fourteenth, twenty twenty three. Right. Um, so yeah, when the the shadow of the moon just kind of right. works away, cuts out. I like the wolf story better. Yeah, the wolf is kind of cool. <laughs> 54 degrees outside right now. 52 in City Field. Woodhaven's right around 53 degrees. Mill Basin's right there as well. Northern numbers are still holding right at the 50 degree mark. We haven't done a lot with these temperatures today, but we haven't had a lot of sunshine. There is some dry air down to our south. So look at what's going on from Trenton to Wrightstown right there. Numbers are responding to that. A little bit of sunshine there. And as you start to work southward, we'll it sounds like part of this build had something to do with like the magical 
men in special places, so the public or the whatever looking at the collapsing star system would have to rely on making some kind of urgency, dependency, and some pop urban culture of some sort out of these people that I didn't pick, but somebody picked to put in these positions in some, however. Um, but now again, I, wolf just, it's, is that elvish for zwolf? Just because it sort of sounds like to my ear at the moment. Star 1978, Star 8378, Nicole Cataruza, it's Earth, Solar System, Milky Way Universe. Galaxy is broken, it's Bayside Station, Bayside, New York, 11361.